Ned Peters was a hustler from an independent town. He wore a college color, a man of great renown. <laughs> He won a college scholar and a man of great renown, but he had a way of doing things and doing them up brown. <laughs> He'd drive four pair of horses just like you'll drive your own team. And you think Joe was a traveling on a railroad train by steam? He'd get that wagon there on time on it and bust the seam. Cause he loved those strong white horses just as cause he loves green. He said he came to Sacramento on a boat named Jenny Lind. Then I headed west like all the rest and went digging in the mines. He carried mail and carried passengers and started on the dot. And his team's horses saw the day was never known to trot. And then team at his end, so they say, was never known to trout. But they went it at a gallop and kept their axles hot. The first stop he signed for was in a place called Naval Hills. His work there was a futile chore, left him nothing but more bills. And Ned, he didn't allow no fooling when engines hove in sight. And when bullets rattled up the stage, he draw with all his might. When bullets rattled up the stage, he draw with all his might. He holler, fellers, give them hell, I ain't got time to fight. He said that mayor in the southern mines his luck turned up the shine. But the man who owned his contract played him foul and wouldn't pay. Then the way the wheels would rattle and the way the dust would fly, you'd think a million cattle had stampeded and gone by. You they sent to pay the fox, tossed him, him, knocked him down, and, and scored him with a knife. Once the mail would get there, just the same. You should be glad the two of them just You'd be so easily but now a free man. And they'd rather be hanged than that in your mind. But the mail would get there, just the same. You'd be glad to see him make his case and die.